What's up, Libra? Hey, Libra. Welcome back to the channel. It is Ashley here at Fire Intuition. I am here to do your love reading. This will be for my Libras. Libra placement, sorry. Um, so wherever you guys have a Libra in your chart, do keep in mind that this is a general and that it may or may not resonate with all of you Libras out there. So please do only take what resonates. All right, and never force it to fit. Okay. So let's see what's going on with the Libra. coming towards Libra. What's the energy coming towards Libra? Or around Libra at this time. What is the energy around Libra at this time? Alright, so we have shock that came out. Sudden change, shock and news, surprises, and epiphanies, transformation. And then we have, oh sorry, heart song. So inner knowing, telepathy, intuition. So your intuition could be screaming at you right now, Libra, and it's trying to tell you something. All right, so hopefully you guys are following and trusting your intuition. We have influences, dark attachments, third parties, okay? So somebody has some type of dark attachment in third parties, okay, on them or around them. Grounding, yeah. So somebody needs to do some type of Reiki, some type of cleansing or aura cleanse. We have grounding next to influences with heart song and shocks. Yeah. So stability and security, performance, growth and endurance. But somebody needs to cleanse their aura, their energy. All right, let's see. We have drifting. So it says, slowly parting, disconnected, and detaching. So, somebody needs to get it together, Libra, because they're allowing these dark attachments and these third parties to get in the way of y'all. Okay? And you're like, it's, yeah, there's no more denial. Be Like, yeah, no illusions. Yeah. There's a snake around you guys. Yeah. I, we have date. Get back out there meeting someone new, setting a date, dating online. So some of you guys are considering and thinking about moving forward and dating somebody new. It seems like this person you guys are dealing with has a lot of shit going on. Okay, like a lot. So. current energy we got the eight of wands all right let's see what the um this is the energy around you let's see the energy that is coming towards you ace of pentacles reverse let's see where your mind is at we have the four of pentacles what's going on in your foundation the emperor the recent past two of cups coming into the near future we have the three of swords How this person currently is feeling towards you, the world card, their intentions, the queen of wands reverse, blockage is the page of cups reverse, and how they plan on moving this relationship forward to no wands reverse. So like I said, somebody has some explaining to do, some work to do, some people or person or a situation they need to let go of or move on from or release or like, mm, mm, mm. they got a lot of shit going on and you guys have new love coming in or around you guys, so... Yeah, they're about to lose you for good. Yeah, for some of you guys, it's like, yeah. So let's see, Libra. Let's see what's going on. All right, so we got the Eight of Wands. This is the current um, energy around you guys. So the Eight of Wands talks about communication, movement, change, things moving forward. Okay. 
So there's a lot of argument, a lot of back and forth communication, but it's like petty or argumentative communication. Like somebody is wanting to argue or being petty or um, confrontational. It could just be some drama as well with this five of wands and this eight of wands. So a lot of drama around you guys as well. Four of pentacles, three of cups. And I got the ace of pentacles reverse. So I do see you guys trying to ignore someone or some type of situation. Hmm. Let me see why the four of pentacles is here. Yeah, so you guys are choosing to ignore somebody. Somebody is like stuck on something. Let's get this about all the ace of pentacles in yours. This is the energy coming towards you. Four of wands. So it's like they never left the situation. It's like they're committed to both of you or in a relationship with both of you guys. I don't know. This seems very weird because they're telling you that they moved on. And they haven't. There's still a relationship. There's still some type of relationship here. But then I see a relationship with you guys. Go to the higher font. They went back to somebody. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wow. And supposedly they're happy right now. We got the sun here. How are... Okay. So they're with both of you. There's two different relationships here. Let's move forward, Libra. This is this is crazy. Okay, let me see something. Why are the four of pentacles here? Going to the four of pentacles. This is where your mind is at. Temperance. So y'all just started working things out and, and y'all just got back together. And then they're but they're lying to you about this other situation, and you know or sense or feel that they're lying about it. So you're not crazy, Libra. I don't know why I was why I felt like I needed to say that, but you're not crazy. You're not crazy, and. And they, okay, so I'm getting like you guys are not crazy. They never, they never ended their other relationship. Libra, let me see something. Y'all know when I have to pull the what's really going on deck, that means something's really going on. So let's see what's really going on with this situation that Libra is in. We have true love, children involved. So there could be some children involved. Maybe they're still in love with this person.
don't know, see what's really going on with um this situation Libra's in. What's really going on? Tell me universe. Let me see. Unplanned pregnancy. Wow. So Libra, you guys can be pregnant or the other person is. We did see that children involved card. We have stalking. Getting married. Is that why the higher font is here? The ex. So there for some of you guys, the ex is pregnant. And they've been telling this person that they're gonna get married and be together and work things out. Oh shit. Let's see. What's really going on? This is too much, Libra. It's too early, but it's stuck in a relationship. So yeah, and so for some of you guys, there was some type of pregnancy or something is going on and they feel like they're stuck in that other relationship and they're there with you though, but went back to this other person and you feel or sense that something is off or doesn't feel right. And that's why you, like, that's why I said like, you're not crazy. Like something's going on. We have a mistake here. Good intentions. iPhone sneaking out. Mm -hmm, let's see. Misunderstood. Let's see. It's not shady. Is that what it is? Children involved. We get that true love. So, I feel like this person is is trying to do whatever they can to keep this other person. But there, for some of you guys, there's an unplanned pregnancy now. For some, not all of you guys. And if there is no pregnancy, this person is trying to get pregnant or do whatever they can to lock in this relationship, so that this person could be stuck with them. And they also know if they get pregnant by this person that this person is gonna stay. I don't know. It's a shit show, Libra. It's some bullshit. Uh, I said it's Tuesday. It's too early for this shit. Um, it's too early. <sighs> Libra, there's too much going on already. Let me see. Let's see why the Emperor is here. This is what's going on with the Year Foundation. Could be an Aries. Page of Cups. Ten of Swords or Universe. So there was a reason they apologized to you recently. Wanted to start over with you. But look, now they're starting to act funny and things have slowed down and changed. Just that quick. See, that's what I'm saying. You know you're not crazy. Something is you feel like something is off. You do. You feel like something is off, something is wrong. You're like, something doesn't seem or feel right. Um, we got this two of cups here. This is in the recent past. Because that will explain drifting, slowly parting, disconnecting, detaching, and it's due to this other situation. Let's see why the two of cups is here. The magician. This is what you wanted, or this is what you guys both wanted. So this is the relationship in the recent past. Queen of Cups, them all in, all in love, y'all in the relationship, mutual feelings, all over each other, can't get enough of each other, all in love. So, the stars are reverse. Two of Pentacles. Some of you guys had some doubt, but you were just like, no, I'm not going to doubt us. I'm not going to, you know, think negative because things are moving forward and we're happy. So, I do feel like in the recent past, you guys, you know, had some doubts, could be with an Aquarius. But at the same time, this person was all into you, giving, giving you guys a lot of attention. So showering you guys with a lot of love and attention. Okay. Um, Dear Libra, let's see. We got this Three of Swords coming into the near future. Let's see why this Three of Swords is here. Yeah, you're going to be mad, hurt, and upset by something you find out. And it's going to come from them. It's going to come from them, but it's going to come. The truth is going to come out in an argument or like some type of disagreement. Mm -hmm. And it's like it's on their mind and it's just going to slip out. Mm -hmm. It's going to come out in an argument and it's going to slip out because it's on their mind. It's bothering them. It's on their conscience, you know, and it's going to bother them. But then they're going to be like, I hope you can work through this and get through this. Like, it's Okay. It can be like, say you guys get in an argument and you're like, oh, I know you slept with them. I know you did this, this, and that, blah, blah, blah. And then, then they're going to be like, yeah, but it was a mistake. I didn't mean that. And I'm hoping we can still get still be together, blah, blah. It's going to come out in a way like that. It's, 
but it's gonna be when you guys are arguing like really bad or like in in the midst of a heavy argument or something like that they're not just gonna come up to you like look i messed around with so-and-so and she's possibly pregnant they're not gonna do that they're not it's going to come out in an argument, and I don't know what you guys are going to be arguing about, but it's going to come out in an argument, and it's bothering them, and they need to get it off their chest and need to say something, and they're going to say it to you during an argument. See? Yeah. The Seven of Swords is here. And I feel like you guys are going to be like, what? Because you're going to be shocked by what they said, but they're going to be like, hoping you guys can work this out. Hmm. Y'all got an interesting reading, Libra. Let's grab this um, world card is here. This is in their current feelings towards you. Let's see why the uh, world card is here in their current feelings towards you guys. We have the Six of Pentacles. No world card. So, because they don't want things to end between you guys, they're going to start doing more. Asking what you need, offering more, giving more, whatever they can do to kind of like smooth things over. So kind of going above and beyond, kissing your ass. What can I do? How can I make this up to you? You know, stuff like that. But yeah. Some of you guys are just not going to feel the same after you find out what you what you find out. It's like the connection, the bond, and all that is there still, but the chemistry and all that. But you guys are going to need some time. You're going to just be like, mm, I don't know. Whatever this is, I don't think you guys are going to be so easy to this like be open to them, you know. They're going to keep apologizing, begging. Mm. Mm. Okay, let's look. We have the Queen of Wands in reverse and their intentions judgment in reverse see so why is this person in their intentions the same person that's causing problems and issues and that's coming in between you guys is in their intentions so why well they feel like until they find out about the baby situation for the baby situation for some of you guys they're going to hang around and kind of figure out, like, if it's theirs, what's going on, you know, for others of you. Let me look at this Queen of Wands reverse because this is a weird and complicated situation. And what I don't like about this Libra, what I don't like about this is that even though they claim they moved on, this is a situation where them and this person always seem to find their way back to each other. And they both still have love and feelings for each other. So... This does seem hard and difficult and complicated. Um, this is a complicated situation. And even though they may say a lot of things about this person, how they don't fuck with this person and deal with them, they always seem to make their way back to this person. And that's the part that is scary because I just feel like this person is going to be in the picture. I'm not going to say regardless, but I feel like this is going to be an issue. This is going to be an issue. This will be an issue. Let's see why this page of cups is in reverse. This is the blockage. What did I say? They keep going back to each other. They both do it to each other. They both move on from each other or claim they're moving on and get with other people and then they always go back to each other. Mm -hmm. That's what they do. When one calls, the other one comes running. You know, 
or when they feel like they're bored or not satisfied in their relationship or they feel like something is missing they reach out to each other or like i said when when their little situation is done with that person they're back hitting up your person what you doing what you got going on i know you miss this i know you want this or they do it to each other and yeah it's a shit show it's a mess libra it is it's a mess why is this um ten of wands universe for how this person plans on moving this relationship forward they're gonna try they're gonna try to let this go and move forward with you but i don't like how the knight of cups is facing this way towards this other person but the fool is facing this way so it's like for some of you libra they're choosing to start over or be with you for right now but eventually they're gonna make their way back to this person okay just so y'all know it's gonna take them a few months before they go back you know um but they are gonna circle back around so um dm libra Not shop energy, justice reverse. Let's see what the T is. What's the T? They're gonna circle back around. Why even start with anybody? And y'all could have been talking about marriage, being together, children, all that type of stuff. But this other person is too much in the picture. for libra romantic love affair see sex fake secret lovers fuck buddies but i'll tell you they're all they they keep messing around with each other we have bad karma so they're gonna get their karma what goes around comes around we have haunted memories flashbacks trauma side effects so some of you guys can be very traumatized by the situation and hurting because you're just like damn i didn't sign up for this shit yeah, the page of swords in reverse. Like, you would have blocked them out and not dealt with them. If you knew this, you wouldn't have talked to them. You wouldn't have gave them no play, no time, no attention, nothing. We have an offer. So they're going to be like, let's go have drinks. Let's talk about this. Fake flexing. Axe rich flosses money. Axe fancy show off. Um, and you guys can also be dealing with somebody that's a show off that really don't have much. And you're like, you got me caught up in this situation? Mm-mm. It's not worth a fight. It's not worth it. Three of Pentacles. Whoever this fake flexor is or the person y'all are dealing with, they're going to try to fight for you, fight to get you back. You know, they're going to try to offer you so much this, that, I'll do this, I'll do that. And they know they can't do it or afford it or I don't know. Libra, tell them you ain't got no time. Love is on the brain, dreaming, fantasizing, daydreaming, nostalgic. So, you know, they're going to tell you that they think about you, only you, they want to be with you. But remember, we got this romantic love affair. That was the first card out. They play too many games. So, yeah. We have cyberbully. You are being bullied online, and they are have suffered from it. So, this person also was, like, reaching out to you, contacting you, seeing stuff, harassing you guys messaging you back to back we have dodging bullets blocking negativity escaping crazy people protected by haters so that's what i'm saying you guys are like damn i wish i would have dodged this bullet because i didn't sign up for this shit no you thought you were jump going into something really good that was gonna be long term and stable this person is also trying to copy and be like you guys and then we have lonely okay so yeah maybe you guys are lonely at that time or this person could have been lonely at the time and was looking for someone or you guys were but yeah i feel like some of you guys are just mad that you jumped into this but also like happy that you got the truth and the truth is out justice is here yeah there were red flags not like there were certain things that you guys see but maybe you guys ignored it you know because you wanted to give them the benefit of the doubt or you wanted to believe or see things differently or you wanted things to unfold in a different way but yeah you're not crazy libra you're not um 
Yeah, they never ended this other relationship and they play games and they're still playing games. Even if they came back and apologized and cried, I don't know. You, mm, I still wouldn't. I'd be like, eh, eh. But, you know, I can't tell y'all what to do, Libra, but this right here is a mess. This is a mess. A big mess. And they know better. They know what they were doing was wrong, but that karma card is coming out. So, like I said, karma is a bitch, and what goes around comes around. So, their karma is going to be losing you, and it looks like you are really good to them. You know, and they could have had something serious with you, but they want to play around. They are still entertaining their ex or whoever they have children with or something like that. And they're going to keep entertaining that person because, like I said, that's what they do. So, at this point, it's like taking a risk. Because I feel like if you jump back into it, you just don't know what you're going to get this time. Because as long as that other person is around, they might make their way back. Okay? Um, circle around. Back to that person. All right, Libra? So that is your reading. If it resonated, please do like, share, comment, subscribe, hit that bell. And if you guys would love to book with me, you already know. Fireintuition.com. Bye, Libra.